Here is my talking book record player that I got in Alamogordo, New Mexico. And I know I had some talking book records, which I got a long time ago, and they were just buried under a bunch of junk. And finally I found them. I got these at an estate sale. And it's Prevention Magazine, December 1981. Made by Eva Tone Sound Sheets. I don't know that the subject matter all that much appeals to me. I'd like to find some books that would be more interesting to listen to. But this is good for demonstration. I put some coins on this. Let me, let me stop it here for a second. It was recorded by Eva Tone. It has braille markings on it. I put some coins on there in order to uh, help keep it down on the turntable. And these are so, if you can't really see the controls, you can tell by feel. This is, I think this is tone and motor power, and this is volume and main power. Let's go ahead and, and listen to the record here. I'm going to have to get my other hand on there. Dr. Okay. Side 2, Prevention, April 1981. Contents of Side 2. Hotline to Health Continued. Supplementing for Optimum Health. How to Push Your Sleep Button. Are We Expecting Too Much from Doctors? Prevention Clinics. Selenium, Vitamin E, and Cancer. Continuing with Hotline to Health. Aspirin. Use with caution when you have the flu. Taking aspirin during late pregnancy may threaten the baby. Besides harm to fetal lungs and interference with blood clotting, the dangers of aspirin could include hemorrhage of the brain in premature infants when the drug has been taken within a week of delivery. Warnings against its use now extend to the final three months of pregnancy. Footnote 1. Medical World News, December 8, 1980, pages 37 to 38. End of footnote. Studies done in Ohio and Michigan implicate the popular drug in cases of Ray's syndrome, a complication of viral diseases such as chickenpox and influenza. Patients with Ray's syndrome suffer severe vomiting, followed by lethargy, personality changes, convulsions, and, in some cases, death. Those reports raise serious questions about using aspirin, for this drug basically does no more than relieve symptoms slightly. Yet, by reducing fever, aspirin can interfere with the body's natural defense against viruses. Footnote 2. Internal Medicine Alert, December 1st, 1980, pages 71 to 72. End of footnote. The old advice, take two aspirin, drink plenty of fluids, and call me in the morning, may still be useful for adults. But doctors might now be more careful about prescribing aspirin for children with influenza, chickenpox, and other virus-caused disorders. Some physicians believe restraint in using aspirin should extend to adults with viral infections, too. Potassium deprivation and hypertension. Potassium levels, which are high in many fresh fruits and vegetables, decline sharply during processing, while salt that is added skyrockets. There's the talking book record player. You can tell that the frequency response is not that broad, maybe 100 to 4,000 hertz or so. But it's the, for the sound of speech, it's not that bad. It's pretty, it's pretty clear. So there's the, the talking book record player. Sometime I'd like to find some more, maybe some, some more interesting novels or something for it. I guess I just have to, just have to keep my eyes out for some more records.